What's up, y'all? Bring you guys another video. This is bring you guys my post fight thoughts of the fight between Yoneski Gonzalez versus Tommy Carpensi. Fight literally just ended minutes ago. Uh, if you guys don't know, there is a thriller event currently going on on Fight TV uh, with, I believe, Pablo Cesar Cano uh, headlining the event. Uh, he's fighting Zorita. I I'm not entirely sure who he's fighting it, to be completely honest, but thriller event. Carpensi and Gonzalez recently just fought. Fight ended in the second round with Yoneski Gonzalez having his hands ra raised in the end, winning the fight by knockout. Very, very good win for Gonzalez. Um, apparently, this is his fourth win in a row now. Uh, with this win, he is now 21 and 3. Uh, Box Rec has yet to update it. Like I said, the fight just ended minutes ago. 21 and 3, 3 losses, 17 wins come by way of knockout or TKO for the 36 year old Cuban. And actually, it's going to be his third win in a row since losing to Alexander Vosdek back in 2017. Oh, wow. He took that much of a long layoff since that lot. Because I haven't seen Gonzalez fight since the Vosdek fight. And it looks like he took more than three years off since then. And this would be his third win in a row. Oh wow, I don't know why the long layoff, but uh, yeah, he took way too long off. And he gave Tommy Carpensi his 8th loss in his pro career. Uh, Tommy Carpensi apparently was only had days notice going into this fight. He didn't even spar for this fight. So he was, uh, you know, he, he, he just showed up and he put up a good fight. He had moments in the first round where I was like, oh shit, he might pull off the upset. But obviously that was not the case. Uh, I did. I give Tommy Carpensi a lot of heart and determination. He, he did show that in this fight, uh, so I respect him for that. But um, but man, he couldn't take that body shot. That was a beautiful body shot by Gonzalez, and Car Tommy was just crawling. Man, I thought he was gonna get up, but he was just crawling towards the corner. I was like, D dude. But can't blame him, man. That, those shots hurt, and um, you know, unfortunately, he he didn't get the uh, upper hand in this fight, and. Uh, yeah, it's probably time to consider retiring Tommy Carpensi. I mean, he's been in there. He's been in there against the likes of Vosdick, Gilberto Ramirez. I'm sure he'll be somebody that uh, the youngsters, that they'll put in front of the youngsters, whoever the youngsters are or will be in the future. But um, but yeah, it's uh, it was a good fight. It was a good fight. Good fight to open up the card. Um, second fight's about to start. If you saw the fight, let me know what did you think about it in the comments. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. Like always, have a great day. All right. Thanks.